Hello, everybody. Hi. Will you do mine too? Yeah. Oh, are you going to do face or Insta? Here's your Instagram. Okay, perfect. Hi, everybody. We're going to jump on here. I want to see. Hello. Hello. Hello, Eileen. Hello, everybody. I hope you're all doing so well. I hope you have a good week. Look, no snow. You see, it's not necessarily, I wouldn't say that it's, it's like a spring warm, day. It's but a spring it's, day. This, it was raining today, and then now the sun, are, the sun is out, so that's good. Mm -hmm. Are you seeing some people on Facebook? Yeah, I'm seeing everyone on Facebook comment so that I can see you. You guys gotta say hi. Hi, Amber. Hello, Donna. Hello, Suzanne. Oh, there we go. Grandma's on. Hi, everybody. Hi, everybody. Okay. <sighs> this is my show today. You want to know why? Because it's Mother's, Mother's Day. Day. Because it's Mother's Day. Do you have special plans for me for Mother's Day yet? I want to ask you specifically. No. Oh, <gasps> you're like four days away. Thursday, Friday, Saturday, three days away. You better get it together. Do you, Grace Ferron? Do you? Yeah. Okay. I always have plans. We're going to. They're in my mind, so they're basically done. Basically done. That's what I always say. Well, listen, we are going to go and have a nice um, Mother's Day weekend. I'm excited. My sister is going to have a barbecue, so I don't even have to do anything except bring dessert, which is even better. So that's really fun, but it's been a good week, a busy week, and a busy weekend. We have Jacobs going to junior prom with his GF, mm -hmm. so he's going to do that on Friday. Saturday, we are going to be here at the store because it's the day before Mother's Day, so I'm sure there'll be a lot going on. Hi, Posh Picnics. Hello, Toby. So anyways, we're going to be doing that, and then... Um, Mother's Day celebrations. I would like to go to church and maybe have breakfast. I think I would enjoy a mimosa. I'm just saying. Mm. Although I like it, I think they're called actually poinsettias because I like it better with cranberry juice, more so than orange juice. I feel like poinsettia is a Christmas drink. So it is a little bit. We could call it something else. Well, we could call it the tulip. tulip? Okay, maybe. <laughs> the tulip. Let's see, we maybe. have some people on Facebook. We okay. have Sarah Jane and Cheryl. Lori, Grandma, hi everyone on Facebook. So today we're going to help you guys out with Mother's Day. This is the third year we're doing it. Yeah. Every year I order a bunch of tulips. I come in. It's kind of a fun tradition. Now. I actually like it. I do it with the girls. We come in. Um, you can order any Mackenzie piece. Well, I can't think any. A bunch. Everybody's panicking behind in my back office right now. Not everything. Don't get panicky. Mm -hmm. There's a bunch on our featured page. I'm going to show you what they look like tonight. We're going to do a lot of switching and swapping. I'll put tulips in your arrangement. We will bundle it all up. It looks beautiful, and you can pick them up on Saturday. So it has been really, really popular. Typically, we sell out because I can only do so many on Saturday morning. So I hope that we people will really enjoy that today, but I want to kind of show you both the apparatus and the, the, the vessel the vessel yeah maybe the, the apparatus vessel apparatus is more of like a machine type oh one. maybe maybe a vessel yeah made the vessel and i want to show you what the tulips look like in it so that will be good hi sammy hello hello oh, our friend douglas is on hey douglas i know i owe you a phone call douglas i know i know i do so don't worry i'm going to be doing that really soon mm -hmm. all right you guys i hope everybody's ready to have a little fun let's do right. it um can you notice these we switched up our balloons and yeah now, Gracie, can you them. do like a video of them when you're done because yeah. I have to tell you guys, these have been so much fun. And I, I think it. I'm always going to have the balloons in the store. They're so fun. And it makes my register area look so pretty. Yeah. I so, like how they match the two looks. In a the lot of people have been asking. So I'll, after the live on the stories, we'll post um, and we'll show you where I get them. We also had a really fun visitor. Donna came this week. Yes, so um, one of our local influencers, um, Donna, and it's Heather Straw Hill, and she has a fantastic Instagram account. It's very heartfelt. It's very real. Her and Grammy came to visit the store, and they are about the sweetest, kindest, most loving people, and were so supportive of me and so believed in me. And it was, like, such a great feeling. I love that when you have those kind of experiences that make you, like, 
like rev up your engines. You know? Oh, okay. <laughs> it did. It revved up my engine. So, anyways, I I liked it. Don't be sassy to me. Go get some flowers. I just oh, I'm Kristen's on. Um, hi, Kristen. Kristen Gator? Yeah. We're gonna be seeing her next week. And yeah, I was thinking. Here, you gotta switch closer to me. I was thinking about next week when we are in, because Grace has a horse show in Virginia. She's talking so to Kristen, excited. her horse trainer, Cater Stables. And we're going to be going to Virginia next week. And do you think that we could just pop on and say hi to people live at 7 o'clock? Um, maybe we can introduce them to the journey. We, I would love to introduce you to Journey. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, so maybe we'll have to do that. So, anyways, okay. Hi, Kathy. Hello. Okay. All right, guys, let's do our first one. So how these work is you can buy them, obviously, on the website completely separate. Um, or you, if you're local, we unfortunately, I can't ship the tulips because they're real. I had a couple questions about that today. Oh, oh yes, pretty, Gracie. Um, okay, so you you do. I like it in your hair. you got to leave it there. Will it stay? Don't move your head. Okay, so where you can buy the vessel obviously separate, or you can buy it with um, the tulips in it. They'll be all on our featured page, so you can check that out. And also, one other quick reminder: Courtly Check Week ends Thursday. Courtly Check Week in a bit ends in a bit. Thursday at midnight. Thursday at midnight. So if you haven't gotten your 20% off on your courtly check items, I don't know what you're doing. Get cracking. <laughs> so anyways, okay. Hello, hello, okay. All right, so this is our first one. I love the royal check with the, um, what color would you say this is? Coral? Orange. It kind of looks like my dress color, which is like corally red orange. Now, there's two different yeah. things that I want to tell you. When we do the arrangements, usually I'll just... We get tulips in all different colors. If there's a specific color tulip that you really have your heart set on, just let me know, and we can make sure that we accommodate I think you. in the, Dad, let me know if this is true, but when you, on the website, when you place an order, can you add, like, a special note or something, or, like, how, know. like, in the, as a gift or something, Aaron? Hey, Jill. Let me see. Okay. Um, okay, so this is called the Royal Check Everyday Base. It's a great size. I wish I had a little measuring tape. Is there one right there on that desk? Um, this is a great size. It's very small. In fact, somebody texted me, Linda. Linda texted me today and got this face because she liked the size of it um, so much. So, Emily, how big is that, honey? Looks like six and a half, seven inches. Yeah, so it's a nice size. Really very, very pretty. Thank you. All right, so, and that's the ceramic. So, I mean... The ceramic is such a process. We posted a video of how those vases are made and how they're hand painted. And, and like, I was ugh. so I was planning for the week on our Instagram and I watched the video and I was in awe of the process. Stop it! I when we saw these tulips, I love them because look at how big they are. Yeah, these are beautiful. These ones um, are like a pretty pink color. I love that. This is now the big version of that vase. Looks like you guys are loving that one as well, too. Um, give us a heart if you think you love, love, love that. Because yeah, I sure do. Um, but anyways, this is um, the ceramic Royal Check Vase. Obviously, this one's a lot bigger. Emily, can I have that measuring tape and just leave it here so I can tell size? Leaves on. Just so people have a good reference. It's just also, look, there's some. There we go. Hearts. <laughs> Lots of hearts. Okay. So this one is about 12 inches and high and about uh, six and a half inches wide. It is really beautiful. Again, with the ceramic, so you have that gold. It, this is like something that for mothers, I feel like this is this is a wow. It really is a wow. This is a this is a wow. This is a like I'm gonna keep this forever and ever. I love the pink too. Matches the bottom. In this, yes. Okay, here, walk around so you don't trip. Okay, Emily, what's next? I love that one. I love that face in general. I love that so face. Beautiful. I love the shape of that face. <gasps> this is my mom's new I favorite do. product. This is, my, this is one of this is in my top ten, I think. I love this. Okay, so this now you can leave that right here, sweetheart. You don't measure. Yeah, that's perfect. Okay, what is this called exactly? Uh, this grandma is, is asking for prices. Oh, sure. I forgot all about that. 
Okay, be watering can. This is $78. Marty, will you put in the comments the other two, how much the other two are? Uh, with yeah. the, okay, so the, just the be watering can is $78. We did it with the orange, which I absolutely love in there today. This is that new watering can I've been raving about with the bumblebees on it. I don't know if you guys can see. Um, Ash, could you come up here and just kind of show them a little closer? Thank you, sweetheart. Um, so I don't know if you guys know, but if you take up oh, your flower fell, that's okay. <laughs> show them the little bees because that is so pretty. Look at this little watering can. Make sure you show both cameras there, sweetheart. Thank you. So this little watering can is eighty nine seventy with the flowers and all wrapped up. And yep. we do a really beautiful job. We put it in Mackenzie Child's box. We cellophane them for you. Maybe we have a picture of what it looked like last year. I think we do. I love wrap. I love doing the Mother's Day gift set, like gift wrapping. It's just so fun and everything looks so pretty after. I know, I know. Okay, these are the yellow tulips, and you can see that these ones we've had these that like have that like natural bend to them. I kind of love that look. I know you that uh, drives you crazy. She likes them when they stick up. But I love it when they kind of flop over like that. And I also love when I'm doing like flower arranging, sometimes I love it when I just have them kind of all off to one side. Actually, I think I probably do it off. I don't know. No, I think this side. And have them just kind of like all off to one side. This is the yellow tulips option in obviously in the picture, which who doesn't love the Mackenzie Child's Courtly Pink picture? So we already did the pricing for you guys so that you would get the 20% off of the teapot, of the courtly check item still, and then we would just have them wrapped and ready for you with the tulips. So they're already have that 20% off. You don't even have to worry about putting in any sort of coat. And then this one is 108 for letting you guys know with the tulips. Was the big one the great vase? Yeah, it was the royal check great vase, which on here it says it would be 319.70. 31970. And yeah. then what were the other ones? And then the little Royal Tech base is going to be 25070. So I'll let you guys know as we go how much they are prices. Okay, well then so that Okay, perfect. it makes it easier. Okay. This is everybody's iconic. Yes, it comes with the little lid of course. So this is the iconic two court courtly check tea kettle. Everybody loves this. Honestly, the tea kettle is always the very first thing that people buy when they're starting their collections, 20% off. We were out of stock of these for months, months and months, and finally I was able to get them back in, so I was really excited about it. You can see, I love using the teapot as I, It's my favorite. Is it? I, when I was doing the pictures for this, my favorite, which I'm not sure if it's in tonight's live as a preview, was the three-quart lapis with this kind of color in it. Oh. It was my favorite. I, well, lapis is everything. But I feel like the tea kettle is always such a great option to, you know, really um, give us a gift. It's like, a great what a great, gift. What a great gift. And what's nice with these is that you're giving a gift, and but without the flowers, it's a practical usage. So yes. it's it's like a gift. That's kind of the, like it. That's kind of the idea. You know, I feel like we can use these in so many different ways. Yeah. I use my tea kettle all the time for florals, and I just kind of, usually what I'll do if I'm arranging it is I'll wire that kind of in there because I just think it looks kind of cute. But if you even if you just have it kind of set up, off to the side even if you had like a teacup and saucer off to the other side it just kind of is like it's really fun yeah. gift so anyways wouldn't it be so fun to give mom breakfast in bed and bring that in with like a latte and a croissant oh. that one like? is 138 138 awesome yeah, I kind of okay. like the droop of these ones see I like the droop too now the yellow in the sterling kind of rocks my world it does I do like I it. love that you know what's so funny? You know what this makes me think of? What? Like years ago when I was a little girl, like you know how you plan your wedding in your mind? Yes, I'm very aware Grace of that. Grace has a Pinterest. Whole I have Pinterest my wedding like, in my mind. I'm my colors myself. when I was a little girl were the bridesmaids were going to wear yellow and the groomsmen were going to wear gray. It's like sterling gray. Wow. It, was a, it was the 80s and I really feel like, I don't know. Comment below what your colors were were in your wedding. It's so funny because now, like, trends are so different than when it was, but I bet you we're going to get a lot of funny colors in here because sometimes people 
we did weird things. Now, I did kind of have these colors because the groomsmen wore black and the girls wore sterling, my bridesmaids. Did you know that? Yeah. But my flowers were like raspberry tones. Yeah. Um, so anyways, but let's see what you guys say. I know. So this is really pretty because it really brings out the yellow and the What sterling. color were your bridesmaids? Comment below. I'm going to be interested to see. What is Facebook saying? And this is 10120. 10120. Can you take that up there, Ashley, so people can see it up close? Comment on Facebook what your wedding colors were. We want to hear it. I have peach. Peach oh, was very peach popular. Peach Maybe peach. put the year too that you got married because I think it is interesting to see like trends. Oh, um, Katie Dreyer said yellow. Yellow. Brown and gold fall wedding. Oh, that's Brown and pretty. gold is kind of coming now too. I feel like that is. That's coming back. Kristen said back. pink and silver. I okay. love that combination. Pink and silver. What year did you get married, Kristen? Oh, six. Oh, well, I didn't know. How do you know that? Well, that's the year I was born. I think it is, right? Oh, that's the year. I also, like, live with okay, them Kathy for a good amount of time. Okay, Kathy is 1998, and she had peach, royal blue, and hot pink in 1999. I feel like yeah, that is... Yeah, 2006. That's for sure, for sure, right. for sure. Okay. I'm going to have you put these ones in. Oh, why? So you can, like, show them what you do. Is there, like, a trick? Oh. Am I going to open this up and there's going to be my mother's date? No, there isn't. Okay. That would have been really cool. Remember, it was... And we like opened Austin. the candy chip box and there was Austin. Like, I feel like we should do something like that I again. <laughs> I can't have a, another puppy right now, though, because I have a very, I have an aging dog. And she is, she would pack and leave, I think. She I would, think she would. She's <laughs> already have tried. That would, good. that would not be good. Would it be goofy to like, okay, let me just see this. Let's, you talk about this and I'm going to arrange. Okay, so this is the, <laughs> she's going to work her magic. Right. This is the black um, the leaves off flower this market tea kettle. This is the two quart as well, which is so pretty. What are you, you doing? What is happening? I just think that would be kind of cute. <laughs> Not really. Um, so this That's one, so let me look on the website to tell you guys pricing. This is going to be $158.70 and it is so pretty with this red color in it because the pattern of the flower market, I'm like really watching her what she's doing so sorry. Well this is how but I would arrange it. I think this looks kind of fun to have one sticking out like this and a little thing like this. Show it. Emily's giving me a dirty look. I want everybody on Facebook and Instagram to know that Emily is giving me a dirty look. It's a little weird. It's quirky. It's fun. It's quirky. It's quirky. <laughs> Black and white dresses with red roses in 1995. I love it. I love it. What Mary? What year did I get what, married? Marty, what year did we get married? 2002. 2002. 2002 because 2003. No, it wasn't 22. 2002. I thought it was 2001 because you three years Marty, ago. Marty, what year did we get married? Yes. I thought it was yes. 2002? Yes. 2002. I was going to say 05, but. but that the Gump was born in 04. Yeah. All right, so 2002. Maybe. Memories. <laughs> mom, mom doesn't know when, what year you guys were born. She knows a lot about you, you guys. Do you oh, know what color her bouquet was? What yeah. color was her bouquet? I don't know. Yeah. It was. Maybe we didn't. Maybe this was a pre-omen, Mark. Maybe it was a pre-omen. No, it was a beautiful wedding and a very special I, day. The pictures of your wedding are so pretty, especially the ones with you walking down the stairs and then like with Kelsey That's and true. Like, those. You are know what? We look like babies in those pictures. We'll have we to do. maybe post one at some. You point. did um, post something like it when you guys did the Wednesday Night Live with the prom theme. Can we switch on to see Facebook people for a while? Oh, Facebook's my my game. Facebook people Whatever. never let me down. I like Facebook people. All right, all right. Okay, what are you bringing me on next? Like, oh, wow. the yellow in the royal. Play with a little bit. Well, these ones are these ones would be a little bit long for this. Should I cut them? No, we have to put them in more Why? more things. Oh, we do. Yes, but I feel like they don't look as pretty. Oh. Okay, but I do love the yellow in the blue. In the blue, I do think that's really really pretty. I like it almost as much as the sterling. And then I think I would like tie this in here like this again. I think that's so cute. Really very pretty. Royal check. Now, do you guys know that every few days, if you trim the stems of your tulips, they'll last a little bit longer. You're also, you know, like if your tulips or flowers are looking a little bit dead, if you put sugar in the water, they'll come back to life. Like a teaspoon of sugar. Are you sugar. sure that's true? Mm -hmm. How do you know? I saw it off Instagram. 
You guys, know. Grace just killed all of your tulips. I'm so sorry. No, because, um, here. <laughs> Lori said Gracie is guardian of the Facebook team. <laughs> Whatever. Whatever, Lori. Don't be on her side. No, but if you get like a I love flowers Instagram with that little little package Instagram in it, piece. that's basically what it is. It's like sweet enough. Instagram peeps. Huh? Instagram peeps is where it's at. Oh. That's what I was trying to say. Instagram peeps. Okay, I do love the yellow tulips in the world. I love the yellow in the world. Something very happy about that. But it's funny because I love this color in the royal ceramic. This red color. In the royal ceramic, but I like the yellow. The I think that just shows the versatility. Yeah. Okay, I would love to put these in, but these are too long, and I we have some more that we they may need to go on. This is all right. Well, give me the other little vessels that we're gonna have to do, and then I'll put it in this one. Next. Well, you can Let's. just put it in so that they're okay. Yeah, just bring me a couple others. Let's see what people are saying. Um, does everybody know? Okay, this is one of my favorite things. Wait, will you give me a hint about what you got me for Mother's Day? No. A dog. Yes, no. I mean, I can. But give no. me, like, a small hint. And then if I guess it right, you have to give it to me tonight. No, I'm not giving it to you tonight. She probably doesn't have it yet. It probably didn't I don't have it yet, yet, but I can tell you what Here, I, I can do. I can do that while we're talking. All right. Give yeah, me a hint. I, I want a hint, yeah. I was tapped. Do you know what it is? You didn't help our children buy me a Mother's Day gift? Wait, no, Grace, what's the hint that you said? I was tapped. tapped. I carried four babies for you. You still owe me a Mother's Day gift. <laughs> Thank you very much. You know what I'm saying? But I was tagged. No. I think you do. I do not. I think I do. Don't. In school today. Okay, stop. I don't know. I don't know. So don't give me too many hints because then I really will guess it. Yeah, you're impossible to surprise. I know. I'm a good guesser. I'm a good clue giver too. What about this? Could, would that be kind of fun to do? My favorite is when it's on the side. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. But there's so many unique ways to do it. All right, let's try this again. These are a little bit long for this one too, but you get the idea. The sterling check, obviously, is ever. I can't tell you. Sterling check is probably our, mm, it might have been our number one seller this week. I'm not sure. Sterling has been Right. Wild. It's wild. Wild. Look at that. Can you show the detail and the colors of there? I feel like with Sterling, you could do any color and it would be beautiful with all of them, but there's so many drag throughs of different colors that I think it's like going to be so the pretty. The Sterling is matching the balloons. Let's see yep. what this price one is. Okay, sounds good. Okay, and then so can I stick those little ones in here too? Two quart so. with the Sterling check is going to be $155.25. Um, will you bring me the little picture that these are going to be in? I don't know that I pulled it out for you guys, but it's on the shelf back there. I just want the to green one? No, like the little, um, it's with water. picture with flowers. Okay. Oh, the, this is the other version of the great face. You want to stick it on there? Um, also something about the new pattern and everything. The sterling? Grandma yeah. says she guesses that your Mother's Day gift is a picture of her. Oh, boy. Okay, so something about the sterling check is I like very modern things. Okay. And I feel like if you have a very modern house, it fits very perfectly in with that clean look. I feel like there's so many different... Okay, so not this picture, sweetheart. We already did this one, the flower market little one. Practical picture. But I appreciate you. Okay. I appreciate you. Um, You guys, if you have not, just side note... In here are all of the names for the hundred dollar gift card. If you didn't comment on, you can do it on either Facebook or Instagram. Will you add them if they do it right now, Mark? No. Our, because well, they'd have to go on the post and do it. Well, they can they can make a new tab and do it. If you guys do it, I think we'll. I will you. write it down over here. We have to page. add you. That's right. We'll add you, but you okay. have to do it. We're only giving you five minutes to go do it. I will set a timer. Five minutes, and you have to go and comment yep. and tag um, a super mom in your life, and two. then we will two add super moms, two. moms and two like the super moms. moms and like the post, and make sure you're both following Insta our Instagram or Facebook, and then we will add you. Wow, that's a new rule. I didn't add that rule, but that's I'm good marketing. It right now. That's a good marketing tool, Gracie. Follow. Okay, this is the little tiny one I was talking about. I have this little one at my house, and I I've always fill it with tulips, and I it makes me really happy. I love this little picture. 
This one. White flower mark, it just makes... I White know, flower mark is so pretty. And the orange, I just wanted you to see. Emily, or Asher, somebody, can you um, bring these up a little closer so you can show all of those colors in there with the orange? I think that looks so fresh. Pretty! That might be one of my favorites. Look at it, it's matching in there. Yeah. I like the lifestyle one. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Good job. Good team effort. I like that one. Please add me. Okay, wow, confused me. I know, I know. So in the comments, on oh, I can the show post. You the post. Okay, there is a post that we did. We started it yesterday. I'll pull it up. Today. And if you go on there and you add two fantastic mamas and like that post, you'll be entered into winning our $100 gift card. We started it yesterday morning. We have all the names here. Marty's writing things down over there. Okay, so this is the post. It's, I don't know. And if then we will feed. tell you. It's that this you one on our entered. feed. So you click on that. Go ahead, Gracie, give a, there you go. Click and this is the that. video. Right. And then you're gonna, this is on Instagram. So sorry, mm -hmm. Facebook, but this is the Instagram. And you're going to comment um, two of super moms in your life, and then we will add you to the, the Add pile. you to. And then we always write, you are entered, so that you'll know that we're not fooling around. We really did enter you. Okay, the gray face here in a different, these colors are so beautiful, aren't they? Oh, With that's the, the last, yeah. Is that the last one? I think so, yes. It is? Yeah. Well, I think we have a few other ones. Do the three-quart lapis. Oh, okay, yeah, let's do the three-quart lapis, because that is one. Look at how pretty that is. Do you love it? I do love it. I love these tulips in general. They're just stunning. Okay, give me hint number two for my Mother's Day gift. I can't. Yes, give it to me. Give it to me. Come on. Loving the gnome mushroom. So bright and so fun. Isn't that cute? That's a new collection. And it also comes with the Poplar Ridge Owl. And there's also the Poplar Ridge Topiaries. There's a whole thing. It's really, really pretty. And this is all I have left of the collection right now. However, I did reorder. So no worries. There was some little birds and whatnot. No problem. Okay. The lapis. I brought the three quart for you. Okay. Here, let's move this over so people can see. Also grab the red flowers. For that? Yeah. Yeah, let's do the red ones in there. I think that'll be good. That's my fave. Um, okay. So, Marty, are there people to add? Yeah. Thanks, guys. I'm glad you're doing it. Really, really fun. Okay. This is the lapis with those that bright orange color. It would be more than this. It would be like the yellow, but I like the orange color in here. So. Yeah, I feel like I always add like enough so it's really full and, and good. Um, but tulips are also supposed to be like simple, so it's like a mix. She makes it perfect for you guys. Don't worry. Oh. Thanks, Gracie. I helped too. I love the lapis. I think that's so pretty. You guys know I've been saying it for over, I don't know, a year that I want to redo my entire kitchen and put lapis in it. And I don't know why I have not pulled the trigger. Well, because we like in our kitchen the, the white, white flower market. Yeah. We brought a lapis home and we didn't love it in our kitchen with the coloring. So we put it in a different room. Um, I put it in we the put foyer. it in our foyer. <laughs> but we like foyer. the white flower market and the courtly check in our kitchen. Um. So. I have a confession to make. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I have a confession to make. What? I did something today, and I'm not, I'm not sure how I feel about it, but I bought myself a Mother's Day gift. What'd you buy? Well, I bought myself the Poplar Ridge Topiaries. For what? For our front porch. I felt as though I really want them. <laughs> and we, I bought them, I brought them in and they sold so fast. I wanted those. You know, they're like six feet tall. But the Poplar Witch ones, my house is yellow and they're gonna look so pretty on the side. And so I figured I really want these. You did these. have four kids. I did have four kids. I mean, that's a Happy lot. Happy Mother's Day. That's a lot of days pregnant. I mean, think about that. Dad, do the math, Marty, in your 30, head really quick. 30, 30 times, times 9. 30 times 9 four. times 4. It's... 30, He's going to get it wrong. 30 times 9. Okay, it's more than 30 weeks. Number no, 30 1. 30 days, days times, times, times 9 months. Okay, so times 30 four. times 9 is 180. Yeah. 
And times that is four. four? Yeah. Well, that's uh, 720. 720 I don't think that's days. Right. Yeah, 360 times two, Grace. 720 days I was pregnant. Yeah. Two years. Two Wait. whole years out of five whole years. That's a lot. So I deserve those topiaries. I'm not going to lie. Four C-sections. I feel like I deserve those topiaries. Hey, and I really watched yeah. them, and I knew you would never, ever, ever do it. It's 1,080. No, 30 times 9. It's 270. No, it's it's 180. It's 1,080. <gasps> that's even more! That's three. No, that's right. That's Dad, nine months. No, 30 times yeah. 9 is 270. So it's three times full four. years. Three full years. Oh, and Ashley, what was that? Who's that was not what you said. Do it again. I don't know what I'm I'm focusing oh on this. Oh, my God. Wait, wait, Ignore it. All right. Well, anyways, I was pregnant a lot, yeah. and I deserve those topiaries, and I ordered them. Dad, did so. you get um, Cheryl on Facebook? She commented. I just want to make sure you added to the pot. Do you, okay. Do you want any more? Yeah. Go get all those names. Sarah from Jane Carr said, Dad, technically you were pregnant for 40 weeks, 10 months, more presents. I agree with you, Sarah Jane. That's a lot of pregnancy. And four whole babies. And wait, you, no, wait, then wait, I wait, nursed. Wait, 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 so wait. I feel like that's still, you're kind of like strapped to that kid. And then Lori said, Marty yeah. gets an A plus on today's math test, but he gets an F because he didn't get it right. So you used a calculator. So oh, I still got it right. Did you throw them in here? Uh, no, not yet. Give me a hey. second. Oh, okay. yeah, it says no. All right. So comment some of your guys. I want to hear your Mother's Day traditions. We always make her breakfast in bed, so that's a Mother's Day tradition. Yes. And um, we give her a gift, make her a card. Cause you know, heartfelt. And I can remember can one. Can you go get the other lit things that we can have them in? Sorry, I didn't mean to There's interrupt you. That's it. We did them all. Huh? Oh. All right. I need more to go in there, but I just got to sign into your Instagram because I got to see the comments on Instagram. Oh, okay. Well, stuff. go ahead. Go ahead, Ashley. Can you go and get those ones for Yeah, go get those. But we always make you breakfast in a card. So comment some of your Mother's Day traditions you want to hear. I'll tell you the most Here. popular um, sales this week. The po most popular Mother's Day gifts this week. Okay. No. Um, there no. has been a very good Sterling check presence, like I mentioned. I just had to reorder a sterling check and it came in so quick. I was so glad. Um, I would say that's number one. A lot of people are taking advantage of the 20% off quarterly check. The picture, I would say, is probably right up there. Um, also, it's been very popular to buy the big urns that Donna was talking about. I don't know if you guys have seen, but the quarterly check and quarterly stripe urns, those have been very, very popular. Thank you, Donna. Um, so I think that's been a really great Mother's Day gift. Like, could you imagine having, I, I have um, the courtly stripe ones in, and I also have the ceramic pots. So, okay. All right, dump them in. Are we good? Yeah, that's it. Do you want to be the winner? I mean, I, the picker? I do want to be the winner, Mom. All right. So this is for the $100 gift card. You guys, I'm going to be doing weekly giveaway. Weekly giveaway. So you got to get on your tagging. And get really good at it. All right. Okay, so wait, 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 wait. You gotta go high. Why? So she's not cheating? So she's not cheating. Oh my gosh. It's Ashley. Okay. okay. Ready? Yeah. So, MB Farewell 4. Okay, so it is M B F A R R E L L 4. That is the winner of our $100 gift card. Will you DM them? M B F A R R E L yes. four. Yes. Ooh, That's I on Instagram. On Insta. I commented the wrong thing. Like okay. All right. You get the hundred dollar gift card. I'm so happy for you. Give us a call or um, DM us so we can make sure that you guys get that. All right. Now listen, everybody. Have a happy Mother's Day. Have a wonderful Mother's Day. If you make sure you spoil those mamas in your life. Make sure that oh it's a, truly about the little things that I think everybody will be happy to enjoy. Let us make your life a little bit easier with those tulip arrangements. Everybody always loves them and they're just, they're just so beautifully done. They just look so beautiful when they're all wrapped up. So we'll, we'll post pictures of what they all looked wrapped up last year. I know Gracie probably has it in her camera somewhere. So I hope you all have a really blessed, happy Mother's Day. And thank you for tuning in and we will see you all next week from Virginia. Goodbye. Bye.